Well, welcome YouTubers toy and toy train buffs to another running session out here in the cave on the Milwaukee Northwestern layout. And today, uh, well first, before I get started, I'd like to thank all my new subscribers. Appreciate you. Hope you enjoy the channel. Uh, we are, uh, we are, if nothing else, about variety. Uh, the layout itself, well, I call it a slow leak in progress. Haven't done much layout work. I've gotten some things in to do layout work on. Uh, I just haven't done it. That's all. Uh, you know, family and home, you know, uh, uh, task and, and whatnot have, have taken over my, my time. And, and as well as my other hobbies. Uh, I do a lot of things with my other hobbies. And I have a toy blog, which I take a lot of photos and, and do projects for. So, yeah, uh, progress on the layout has been slow, but that's okay. What I'm doing today for Memorial Day is running two train sets that have been featured in previous videos, except that this is the first time they've both been featured at the same time on the same layout. And that's pretty cool. Normally, for Memorial Day, uh, I kind of like to do parade setups, Memorial Day parade. I just, just didn't you know, I uh, just didn't get around to it this year, and that's okay. There's always Veterans Day, right? I'll, uh, we'll, we'll shoot for a Veterans Day parade or something. Alrighty, besides, you know, our fire crew is still at work trying to battle this fire. They've been at it now for months. <laughs> They're either slow or it's, it's a very pesky fire. Uh, one, of the, one of the two, I don't know. Alright, let's bring up this first consist. Okay. Why is it starting to do that now? There we go. Thank you. All right. Both of the train sets I'm running today are what we call uh, Modern Marks. The actual name of the company was Marks Trains. All right. I won't go into the history now, but we'll leave it at that. The Marks trains were produced in the 90s and early 2000s. And, uh, for example, we'll show you this. This first set we see here is set number 10471, Mobile Military Supply Train. It was announced in the 1996 catalog from Marks Trains. And it was actually uh, introduced or, or for sale in 1997. So it has a uh, Canadian Pacific style engine with can motor and coffin style tender. Then it has the, the ordnance boxcar, high side gondola with shells and sandbags, fuel oil tank car, a dual spotlight car, flat car with a duck, D-U-K-W, called the duck in the military, then the mobile barracks, as well as a U.S. medical unit that serves as the caboose. Alrighty, that's the first set. I think what I better do is pull that forward so I can bring up the next set. Alrighty, now we'll bring up the next set. Again, modern marks, uh, sometimes called new marks. Uh, this set is the set number 10703. Marlines Military Support Train. Alrighty. And it has beautiful lithographed Canadian Pacific 040, just like the other one. The other engine was an 040. This has the Marlines Wedge Tender. This also has an Ordnance Boxcar. But then it has four flat cars with military loads on them military police. Signal Corps, Ambulance, 
wrecker and bringing up the rear is the troop barracks okay now uh, as an aside Mark's trains did not make these cars these cars were made by a company called Dime Store Dreams founded by Bill Hanlon who was a uh, a noted uh, toy designer in the 50s and 60s also an author uh, he authored the best, one of the best books on, on, on plastic toys out there. Uh, uh, <clears throat> plastic Toys, Dime Store Dreams of the 40s and 50s. Awesome reference book. Now, Dime Store Dreams at the time was a division of binary arts. And they existed from 2001 to 2000, I should say, until 2003. And put out about 30 different vehicles. Five of them are uh, military. Now, the Marks catalog, Marks Trains catalog at the time says there were five loads available, but this set only included four flat cars, four loads. All right. The cars themselves, like I said, were produced up until 2003 and provided to the Marks Trains Company. Alrighty, I think that's enough history. So, let's say we just watch military trains run, army trains.
think we're going to bring her on home. Alrighty, that'll do it for today and for Memorial Day. Uh, remember folks, today is a day to remember those who, uh, who gave their all in service to their country. Alright, so take a little time to remember what they did for us. And I appreciate you watching. And until next time, tschüss, adieu, auf Wiedersehen. Bye y'all.